So Paul Bircher has been going live on TikTok a lot, so you might want to follow him on there so you don't miss, miss him. But certain things that you need to know about Paul is that he likes to call us his Paul Pack, and he thinks of us as his animals, and he hates being called Dustin from Zoe 101. He says, because people ask him, do you like being called Dustin, or do you mind it, or whatever, and he says, well, no, my name is Paul. I would like to be called Paul, that's my name. And then you guys keep asking him about the Zoe 1 or 2 movie, not show now, it's now a movie, that's coming out. He is not a part of that movie. He doesn't want to be part of that movie. Yes, he knows what's going on, but he's not going to spill the beans. And he said that he has no beef with Jamie Lynn Spears and that he loves Jamie and needs to talk to her again and the rest of the cast. He said for personal reasons, which he does not want to tell us, he is not doing the movie. So here I am saying hello to him. Then here I said, you the man, because I was trying to get him to talk to me. And then I said, love the music, because there's new music out called Horses that he said was about his time on Zoe 101 and he said he did have fun doing Zoe 101 and then me saying I love the music again and then, and then me talking about Paul I said you're a Paul not a Dustin and then he asked do you like his hair because he is going to be in a new movie and a new show where he needs that hair he can't tell us what it is yet, but when the time comes, he will tell us, he said. And my bet, and I'm about to lose space on this card, so when I do, I'm done talking. So later haters, just in case. And then I said something about his music. Oh, he asked if we liked the color of his hair. I said, it's nice hair, lol. And then I said, love the Freddy too, because he has a Freddy cougar poster in the back because he loves Freddy Cougar. I said Paul is amazing and then I said I am your animal lol because he's calling us his animals now. Okay I cleared some room on my SD card to finish this but yeah I said hi. I said his name is Paul not Dustin because I kept seeing people going are you Dustin? Is that Dustin? Oh, Dustin. Oh, I love you, Dustin. Oh, Dustin, I have a crush on you. And when he hears that people have a crush on him, he's always like, oh, huh. he smiles and goes, uh -huh. thank you, and plays with his hair, which is fine, whatever. And he's not going to be mean and be like, could you call me Paul? My name's not Dustin. That's just the character I played. And then they kept asking him and begging him, could you play or could you sing the gummy worm song we all have the gummy worm blues right now and he's like no the only way i'll sing that song is if you guys you know give me a lyric from that from that song because i really don't want to do it um and nobody did of course and I respect him if he doesn't want to do it. There's videos out there of him singing the Gummy Worm Blues song. So just go watch that. I mean, it's something he did in the first season. So why are people, like, obsessed with that? And, like, leave the poor man alone. He will do the Gummy Worm Blues song if he wants to. And I, someone goes, is that Dustin? And I said, no, it's not Dustin. It's Paul. Because his name's Paul Bircher. And then I did a bunch of hearts and then said you were out because I was trying to get his attention. But yeah, it didn't work. Someday I will. And it's weird how he goes, he's in California. That's, he gave it away that he lives in California. So he's running on California time. And he's like, well, it's getting late. I'm going to go. I'll probably be on in an hour to tell you guys can good night or whatever. Which is really sweet and nice of him. And he... 
loves going live, so that's pretty cool. And just chit chatting and whatnot. And then he started asking questions. It's called, it, this says, What is one thing you can't live without? So if you're watching this, comment down below and tell me what's one thing you can't live without. And I said, and, and, and when you tap the question to answer it, it says, Discuss with Paul, I would dance to Paul music. I said that to get his attention. But one thing I cannot live without is music and TV and the internet. Like, how did I live in the 90s without the internet? That's what I want to know. I know I did a lot of writing that now I'm regretting doing and have to do throw away those papers. But, yeah, you can answer it down below. Whoops. The next question was, if you had a superpower, what would it be? And I said fly, which is true. I would definitely want a flying superpower so I don't have to walk anywhere. So when I'm at work, I can just, if I'm at the mega bar, which is the deli and salad together, if I was at the mega bar, I would be like, oh, I need this, this, and this. I'll just fly right there and go as fast as I can, flying to my destination, get what I need, and then fly somewhere else, get what I need, you know, and fly back. That would be cool. It's kind of like teleporting, but we're flying. Because you're still trying to get there, but yet you're not going the easy route with teleporting, you're doing it with flying. It's kind of, it's kind of neat. What would you, okay, what would your superpower be and why? Comment down below that answer. If you had a superpower, what would, oh, psh, why did I, oh, the other one was, why do I have that twice? Oh, I said I would, and then I changed it to music, and then he changed the question, as I said it. Okay, that's the confusion. So I don't know what the other question was, because it was a third question. But anyways. And then he wanted to battle somebody, because apparently you can battle somebody. Meaning, while they're live and you're live, you can battle, and people in his chat can pick, tap the screen, and it does this, or hearts. And you can, you can tap, 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 and he says keep tapping, and these scores come up, and you get to pick, if you like her, then you go to her live stream and do the same thing to her, and so on. And you just tap, 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 and then after so many minutes, you have a winner, which is pretty cool. And then this one. I said, he likes being called Paul, which is true. He does like being called Paul. He done said that several times in the chat. And several times he keeps having to repeat himself because new people come in and they're like, are you in the Zoe 101 movie? Bitch, if you want to know who's in the Zoe 101 fucking movie, why don't you Google it and find out if he's in the movie or not? Because the cast is already revealed. He's not in it, and Victorious is not in it. Because when Victorious left the show, she had a fallout fight with Jamie Lynn. Reasons why she left the show. And there was a spin-off show of her own. Which he says he regrets trying out for and trying to be in that show. So, therefore, he's not having a falling out. He just doesn't want to be a part of it anymore because things change and people just I think the reason why they ask if he's in the Zoe 101 because they want to hear his side on why and they don't know how to ask him why are you not in the Zoe 101 reboot so yeah but just google it and you'll know guys he's not in Zoe 102 <laughs> and then I made these of all the things that I said and I posted them on Twitter but, 
more if you want to see close-ups of just them by themselves go to my white cats or no I think it's called Stacy's Famous Peoples I don't know just ask me and I'll get you the link in the comment section it's a group page on Facebook where all these pictures of him going live on TikTok will be I will make a section that says there is a section right now that says Zoe 101 photos and then it says Paul Butcher photos and then I'll make one for TikTok that says Paul Butcher live on TikTok and then you can go there and see him so I have them like this made up but I also have them individually that I will be posting and if you see my name White Cats written on the photo is because I don't want you to steal them claim them as yours I want you to know who took the screenshots and his hair kept doing wild all I can say is his hair was doing sexy things and yes I have a crush on it but his hair was doing so many different things he kept playing with it and whatnot and then showing his muscles and trying to be sexy and it's like and he even one time in the chat goes am I sexy dude why are you asking us if you're sexy because you know what our answer would be when you heard a lot of us saying you're cute I mean they have a crush on you I'm like what I mean I have a major crush on them so yeah <laughs> but anyways I'm gonna get going I will talk to y'all later. Later, haters. Haters, me.